My idea was an app called Phoenix Mind. Through this app idea, yes, I also suffer from allergies, very severe allergies, and I have suffered this problem a billion times. Oh, we have got a lot of coconut trees. Majorly, it is destroyed by the red palm weevil attack. So we have thought of an idea. My project is biodegradable plastic. What is biodegradable plastic? that moving electrons we can make electricity for it is basically work on the most of the old old age people's uh, being alone can increase their depression so i invented this project my project uh... Uh, talking about how it solves the problem i have designed uh, the rover in such a way that it can in future as i have to, as i have told that these agricultural harvesters are highly affordable by the farmers and we are even planning on Hi, I am Harshita Prasad, a student of grade 9 and I am a 14 years old. And my idea was an app called Phoenix Mind, a digital BFF. So through this app idea, the adolescents are going to have a friend 24-7 and it will attend to them all their problems and hence help them reduce depression signs and suicidal signs. So this will be a peaceful impact on all over the world, reducing suicide attempts, depression and making harmony. I have always been fascinated by the cutting edge technology such as AI, ML and computer vision and even the leading industrial uh, leaders they say that AI is in an age where it's solving problems that were considered to be in science fiction. So I was inspired by it and I thought to explore more use cases based on these technologies and being an adolescent myself I noticed that uh, the biggest problem that I faced or that adolescents faced was depression and suicidal signs. So I was inspired by this and I tried to explore in this area to land on this idea. I have not made the app I have I'm on the prototyping stage so I have I did apply it in you know different places so yeah sometimes it uh, you know did not go through sometimes it did went through so it did go through so it was a good experience to um, going through it so I'm Sanjata Kiran and I'm 17 a 12th grader from Zari Public School Raurkela Odisha and I've always been really interested in technology that is why I decided to make this application Allergenius which helps in identifying whether a packaged food product has allergens or not a lot of people who suffer from allergies, they struggle to find whether a certain food product has allergens that they are allergic to or not. I mean, sometimes it's mentioned and sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's in really fine print and easily missable. So the thing is, I also suffer from allergies, very severe allergies. And I've suffered this problem a billion times too. And I conducted surveys and I found out that I'm not the only one who's suffering from this. So that's why I, I sought to look for an answer for it and decided to make allergenia. Very positively impacted my own life. In the future, I'm planning to incorporate it in various shops and stuff and contact companies and partner with them. That way it will reach a lot of people and will help allergy sufferers from all over the world. So as of now, the AI model contains a data set of about 3000 images, but the accuracy level is still 60 to 70 percent and I hope to get it to at least 90 percent. So for that, I need more information from various companies and everything and I have been in touch with a few of them as well. And I have been making this project since the past two three months and I think I've made substantial progress in these months. Hello everyone, I'm Lana Lynn of class 10 KVCRPF Palipuram, Trivandrum, Kerala. Red palm evil is a common pest which attacks the coconut trees on the crust by digging a three centimeter deep hole and laying hundreds of eggs. After some days, the egg will hatch and the larvae will start feeding on the crust, literally de destroying it within a few months. So from prevent this from happening, I have designed a model or device which will attract the red palm weevil by the fluorescent light and get strapped and the biopesticide will be sprayed for at most 10 seconds. My model is not placed in the uh, tree. It is placed on a pole which can be adjusted by the height and there is no over usage of pesticide in the trees as well as on the ground. So it will be very helpful for the farmers as well as the consumers. I got inspiration from my mom and my father. Oh, we have got a lot of coconut trees majorly it is destroyed by the red palm weevil attack so we have thought of an idea for prevent that from happening
literally using my device will help others in the future in such a way that uh, usage of pesticide can be reduced because it uh, it only uses a little amount of pesticide in it and it was only sprayed and fumed for at least 10 seconds and the usage of pesticide can be reduced and the uh, environment can be saved. I'm S. Haripriya. I'm studying in SVG school in Udmalpet. My age is 17. My project is biodegradable plastic. What is biodegradable plastic? Makka kuria plastic kal. Nam idhi eppuri thayarikinu umdi na? Starch, proteins and idhi allathiyo seeth karkana oru bond. And the bond in the glucose and the starch vandu nam enna starch vana use panikla. Corn starch, potato starch, any starch nam adhi use panikla. Nam vandu idhi allathiyo add panni acetic acid nam vandu use panikla. Oru weak acid nam adikano. So adhi kaanu vandu nam kurumbu convenient a arkadhu vandu acetic acid. So adhi nalam adhi edhi kuro. Idhi allathi nam add panni medium heat la nam vandu heat panni umbodhu. It turns into like a jelly like structure. Ippu nama vandu tu adhi nama vandu tu namak enna mold veenu mo. Andha mold ila nama uthano. Ippu vandu nama plastic bag veenu mo. Nama adhi la use panna. Illa nama vandu tu water bottle veenu mo. Nama adhi use panni. Nama vandu tu it turns in the madhi pantu. Nama vandu tu 2 to 3 days nama vandu tu nama sunlight la kaya vekeno. So this is a process. Process to make a biodegradable plastic. Ippu adhi nama vandu tu enga arindu nama kattu kutta yam abdiin sonna. Enno adhi inspiration vandu enno adhi suthi irukkar aedan na. Ippu nama plastic nama petroleum plastic use panna. That is 500 years of degrade. So, what do we use to use the paper bags? We have 14 million paper bags per year. We have 14 million trees per year. So, we have to destroy our self needs. So, what do we use to use the paper bags? That's why we use the biodegradable plastic. We go anywhere. If we want to go shopping, we want to go to the store. We don't have to go to the store. We are human errors. We are human errors. We are human errors. Now, when we go there, we have a plastic bag. That is very convenient. If we want to go to the store, we will go to the shopkeepers. So, now, we are going to go to the plastic bag. We are going to go to the biodegradable plastic. It should be more convenient to us. Cloth bags and paper bags are very helpful in the future. So, we are going to go to the future. फ्यूचर लव आंधे टे इट ग्रोस अप इधर वंदे टे नमक ना वंदे टे फर्स्ट नमक सर्च पन्ना इधर वंदे टे इधर लान नमक वंदे टे एप्परी पन्नो नो अपनी न्यूज़ पन्नो बोध ना पाक बोध इंटरनेट ले नमक वंदे ना रे स्टर्च सर्च पन्ना अपना वंदे स्टार्च प्रोटीन सो इधर लाती इधर पन्नर कानो एक बांडन सनांगा so, we use the starch to use corn starch, but we use the starch to use the starch. We use the starch to use the starch. Then, we use the gelatin to use the starch. So, we use the starch to use the gelatin or agar-agar. This is a biodegraded product. So, we use the starch to use the starch. Then, we use the starch to use the starch to use the starch to use the starch. Instead of starch, corn starch and vinegar and we will add it to that attempt and we will succeed. Then, we will add some plastic bags and we will add some time to add some plastic bags. We will add some time to add some time to add some time to add some time to dry. So, this is a drawback. What is the problem? We have to use the raw materials. Like in agriculture, we have to use all the products to be biodegradable. So, we have to use all the raw materials to be dependent on agriculture. So, we want to increase agriculture. Like, we can grow at a great level. My name is Muhammad Safwan. I am studying in 11th standard GHSS Manathala. My age is 17. Okay, when I came to my idea, it's basically working on the photoelectric effect. That means in the chemistry that when a radiation hits on a metal, the electrons will gain some energy and it will eject. Through that, we can through that moving electrons, we can make electricity. For it is basically work on the in space exploration, future space exploration, and uh, in the Mars, we are considering Mars planet. Uh, the Mars is affecting uh, most of the radiation coming from the solar sun. Okay, uh, and we place a, replace the solar panels by using these uh, panels. Uh, it's a less ionization metal containing elements containing metals we are using here. So, 
when the radiation hits on it, uh, it will gain according to the frequency of the radiation, the kinetic energy of the electrons in the metals will increase. So through that moving electrons, we can get a huge amount of energy by increasing the frequency of radiation. Okay. And the main impact in the future is the future space exploration. We are, uh, we are having so many lack of energy and fuel for space exploration. Through this technology, we can gain new energy production in the space and industries becomes more in space exploration mining and also uh, replace uh, solar panels in the satellites and the high orbitals uh, high orbital satellites uh, by this technology it is more efficient than the solar panels solar panels only converting light energy into electrical energy through this technology most of the radiation is, uh, from the sun is converting into energy mainly inspiration is for that uh, when i study photoelectric effect in the 11th standard in chemistry I get the idea from that and I know that sun is radiating a huge amount of radiation. I already know that through when I apply that, tech, that uh, effect through this uh, as radiation. That means uh, radiation is uh, uh, from the sun and the photoelectric effect uh, through that we can make a photoelectric effect is also already proven earlier. Uh, so we only need to consider the engineering uh, engineering techniques of this uh, device uh, for implementing in orbital spacecrafts and uh, mainly in martian surface uh, that only we need to consider uh, so uh, mainly practical experiments are needed for doing this uh, in the gravitational and uh, to the radiation heating or everything we need to experiment conduct experiments based on this. Hi, my name is Ram Vyas. I'm from uh, Chinmaya Vidyalaya PACR, studying 10th. Uh, my project name is 8 Smart Speaker. Most of the old, old age people are living alone, with, living alone and uh, some of uh, them are living with their uh, son or daughter who will not be available all the time with them. They may face some difficulties at the time when they are alone, like uh, they will be finding difficult to take medicines at the right time and uh, uh, being alone can increase their depression. What if a uh, medical difficulty such as heart attack occurs or uh, any other uh, calamities like uh, if what if a burglar attacks the house and uh, they, they don't have any help. So I invented this project. My project uh, a, 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 a smart speaker can uh, have a friendly interaction with the user uh, and uh, it can also uh, automate our home like uh, turning on bulbs, fans with the AAD smart, a, a smart speaker and uh, if any uh, medical difficulties or uh, if an, any emergency it automatically alert, alerts the police and uh, the ambulance through mail. Everything happens through IoT and uh, everything is secure. The old age people, they can uh, overcome their difficulties. I, I took the, this project from as we are uh, in a joint family right now. I took inspiration from my uh, old grandparents and uh, some of our relatives as they are experiencing this. So to solve this problem, I have, uh, this, I have made this project. I have uh, presented this project to two, three competitions. But uh, I wasn't good enough to uh, show up it and uh, after facing some uh, difficulties I have uh, overcome and uh, made this project a successful one. So, Namaste everyone. My name is Anish and I am from Haryana, Kurukshetra and I am from Wisdom World School. So what I made is basically a design of space rover that is able to solve many of the problems that has originated till the time in the space exploration. Uh, talking about how it solves the problem, I have designed uh, the rover in such a way that it can it cannot tilt in any case or if it tilted, it can actually come back to its path anonymously. And uh, talking about the inspiration, when Chandrayaan 2 failed in 2019, I fell deeply for that and I designed this uh, space rover and finally due to Young Scientist India, I physically made the prototype. So, uh, as we are in uh, need to explore every planet in our solar system or any exoplanet also. So this vehicle will play a very major role in uh, exploration of the many planets and other exoplanets. So it took around one year to prepare the design and for physically making it, it took three attempts. In the third attempt, I finally realized uh, that uh, this rover is not like it failed but then I made a separate design and executed it and it finally worked. I'm Sir Mehtab, 
and I am from Paramita Heritage School, Karimnagar, Telangana. The name of our project is Multifunctional Agricultural Machine. The innovation involved in developing our project is the use of law of concurrency of diagonals in hexagon in making an agricultural tool. Our harvester is highly used by the marginal agricultural, har agricultural farmers. So this can play a major impact in the lives of marginal farmers. And as we are using the law of concurrency of diagonals in hexagon, the harvester will be highly balanced and whatever the yield will be produced, it will be highly productive. In future, as I have, to, as I have told, that these agricultural harvesters are highly affordable by the farmers. And we are even planning on getting uh, partnership with the government as suggested by the Space Kids India and trying to make our harvester be used by each and every agricultural, harvest, agricultural farmer. As we can see in India, many farmers find it difficult in affording high cost harvesters. So we have, I have personally gone and visited many farmers and there are nearly 50,000 modern agricultural harvesters but they are not enough to every single farmer. So I have developed my prototype so that all, all farmers can use my agricultural harvester. It took us three complete years to develop our prototype. First of all, whatever the prototype we made, first of all it was just a design. Then after researching with CSIR, CSI, CSIR experts and after visiting ICIR, Indian Council of Agricultural Research, we have taken some major we have done some major efforts in developing our pro prototype and even after that we have failed several times and then we have come up with the final prototype and have taken some advices from the Space Kids India to like finally give the mo business model of our project. I would like to thank Space Kids for helping us develop our business model and I would like to thank my parents and my family and our institution for helping us develop our final prototype and I would even like to thank my guide teacher Lalit Mohan Sahosir for always continuously helping me. Thank you everyone.